Well, according to the CDC, at least 1.7 million adults develop sepsis in the U.S. in a typical year. And data shows many U.S. hospitals don't have the resources to identify and treat this life-threatening medical emergency as early as possible. In today's Health Minute, Mandy Gaither has more on a new device that one hospital is using to help some patients. It's a body's extreme response to infection. Sepsis is a life-threatening condition requiring urgent medical care to prevent organ damage and death. I don't think the general public really understands how dangerous sepsis can be. Sepsis can be hard to identify. It has a wide range of symptoms, including confusion or disorientation, shortness of breath, high heart rate, fever, shivering, extreme pain, and clammy or sweaty skin. A 2022 survey of more than 5,000 U.S. hospitals showed only 73% reported having a dedicated group charged with monitoring and reviewing sepsis care and outcomes. But at El Camino Health, officials say a new device is helping improve patient care. Flow patch is changed the game, really, in managing sepsis treatment. The device adheres to the neck of a patient and wirelessly transmits real-time data to the healthcare team, allowing them to monitor fluid management, a key part of sepsis treatment. Oh, there's no doubt uh, that because we've been able to very rapidly assess patients using this tool, uh, we have been able to uh, manage their treatment plan more quickly and efficiently and save lives as a result. For Health Minute, I'm Mandy Gaither.